France has long been a pioneer in tank design. The Renault FT-17 tank was the first true modern tank, with its main weapon located in a fully traversable turret. French tank designers continued this tradition with the development of the Leclerc main battle tank. Named in honor of Marshal Philippe Leclerc, who led the Free French 2nd Armored Division in the liberation of Paris in 1944. His namesake tank entered service with the French Army in 1990. The Leclerc has a traditional turret design, but incorporates many advances in its fire control system. The turret was designed around its innovative auto-loading system. The smoothbore 120 mm gun uses the same rounds as those used in the German Leopard and the American Abrams tanks. The long gun of the Leclerc provides the rounds a higher muzzle velocity, affording a greater range. A 7.62 millimeter machine gun sits atop the turret and is controlled from within the tank. It is also fitted with a larger 12.7 millimeter coaxial machine gun. The Leclerc's fire control system can track six targets at once, providing real-time imaging from all the tank's sensors and sights. This system can be operated independently by the gunner or the commander. A sophisticated battle management system integrates data from other tanks and upper levels of command. Tank crews no longer communicate simply by radio, but exchange critical information through digital data systems. The Leclerc was designed around a centralized computer architecture. In battle, the Leclerc is in constant communication with other armored vehicles in its unit. This allows the crew to be aware of the precise location, fuel status, remaining ammunition, and other relevant information for each vehicle in their battle unit. Advances in anti-tank weapons develop so quickly that armor protections can become outdated in less than five years. The Leclerc addresses this problem by using modular armor packages placed over a steel hull and turret. These packages can be updated and replaced as new armor technology develops. Not relying simply on armor for protection, the Leclerc is fitted with a Galix Combat Vehicle Protection System. Nine launch tubes are fitted on either side of the turret roof. The Galix system can launch infrared decoys in anti-personnel or smoke grenades. This system allows the tank to launch its smoke grenades, then retreat to conceal its exact location. One of the key differences between the Leclerc and other contemporary tanks is its replacement of a human loader with an automatic loading system, reducing the crew size to three. The smaller crew has contributed to the Leclerc's status as the lightest main battle tank in the world today, weighing in at only 56 tons. Le char est 
n'est pas des maillons essentiels de cette politique. Le char Leclerc, en 1991, sera capable à la fois de percer tous les chars existants euh, sur le champ de bataille, mais également sera susceptible euh, de répondre aux 